is the chance of England coming through on it for a breakaway. Williams into midfield with Mialamu. Mialamu carries so Take well. Go, go, go. He's more than a handful, isn't he? He's two hands full. McCall looking to use his hand with the handoff. Turn right. One goes low, one goes high. Thompson and Flood combine. Matthewson. Williams to gear. And well picked up by the big man, Thorne. A lot of players wide for Wells, if you can see. They've gone for the kick. Morgan Stoddart waits on the wide outside. Semenzato. Orquera. Canalis, Garabi. Alessandro Zani, number Eleven. seven. Of course, so much damage there. A faint on the outside. Sharp is in midfield, and his pass was good to find Quake Cooper. On to Matt Gitto. He's got Drew Mitchell. Who's just loping across the ground, going that little bit faster. Shantane Harvey held by Joe Rocafoco's run, then Ben Young's always up against it to get wide. So three on two, and you thought, blimey, Jose Aguirre, could he score here? Ground stood by England, but it's a five metre. That night. He's getting his chance here now early because Paul Deacon is injured. And here is O'Loughlin, and this is Carmon. Bullet hands. Charlie comes inside, and Charlie gets another. <coughs> Boom, a real collision. Just couldn't get his head out. Gave him his debut in 1997. Back it comes to Wheeler. Wheeler then finds Wellens. Wellens to Lomax. Lom he lost the ball. Had he managed That's to plonk right, it down, guys, not on. via the. Post pad, who knows? Carmont, Wigan looking really threatening down this left hand side. Good strength from Charney, just brushed Eastman away. That would have been blown in previous games, so full marks to the referee with how he's doing today. Here's Tompkins now, he's joined the line, he just loses to St. Helens just as Michael Maguire came last year, and he will have been told by his supporters get us to a grand final and beat St. Helens. This is Gleason. But yet, was dragged back. Well, this is a glorious opportunity for St. Helens. That's Dixon. Eight from the line with Eastman. Back it comes to Wheeler. Good movement behind the ball from St. Helens. Here is Shenton. This is the fourth game we've done, Steve. It's like two weeks, this. It certainly is, uh, okay. but it's, it's been great. I've enjoyed every minute of it. Charmont trying to get away from Eastman. Eastman, credit him. I was going to say he stuck to him like glue, but. Didn't complete the tackle, Carmon carries on. Go. Go. Huge go. figure go. of Jeff Lima, now it's go. with Eastman. Eastman then gets it away to go. Wilkin, go. no go. way through for Wilkin. That door go. was slammed shut in his face. Here's Graham now attacking the line, back it comes to Eastman. He's got away from O'Loughlin because he gets the ball to Wellens, great line. Go. The pay here now with a goal line drop out. Okay. McElorum to Lulawai, finds the go. runner on his right hand go. shoulder. Martin Go. Gleason, McIlorum, Lulawai, O'Loughlin, Farrell, wide to Carmont, making hay. His tally up and running in 2011. Quick hands, came on the oh, angle, man. beautiful stuff. Oh, Go! Three. This is Coley, here is Lulawai, there's O'Loughlin, quick hands, down this left channel again, goes Tompkins, it goes wide, and here is Charnley. Didn't fancy take end of Super League 16. Wins earlier for okay. Huddersfield okay. against Warrington. For Hall, uh, for um, oh. okay, Lulawai. Oh, and Harris. Better than that, but it wasn't a penalty. Not with you, Brian, on that one. That, 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 that looked forward. Right. That looked forward, it did. Oh. And as McAdorum had to play the ball, finds Sean O'Loughlin, who finds Lulawai. He'll attack it. Tompkins slips one net. Can't the Millennium Stadium, Millennium Magic's final match of the opening day. It's with Wilkin. Wilkin finds Lomax. Lomax wide to Mary. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Pass from Lomax. Has taken a bang. He's in back play at the moment, just I think spitting a bit of blood as Sinfield ships it onto Webb. Webb out wide to Ben Jones Bishop. He's got the legs. He's got the core. I'm done by the kick. But it's clear in the opening 20 minutes of this match that Mick Potter and the Bradford Bulls have a risk. Wasn't the best of offloads and he got a fortunate ricochet. 
Here is Royston now. Royston, a member of the Halifax Champions.